We have uh, a very special guitarist, and uh, I used to play guitar in a very uh, amateur way. As a matter of fact, uh, I was a member of a duo that won an amateur concert te test. Uh, I didn't do very much. I just played a little four-string stuff. The other guy did all the work, man. He was all over the place. The guy named Cooper Gibson, he was a wonderful guitarist. So he really won. He just needed somebody to play some chords so that people could hear what he was doing. And uh, uh, But there was, there was, I was sold. I mean, I, I just loved the sound of the instrument. I mean, I heard Django Reinhardt, and I heard a bunch of other guys, and they, they had uh, so much spirit in the things that they did. Well. The gentleman who is playing guitar with us has the same kind of spirit. He's done something uh, a little different. I mean, he's good. He's one of my good Southern brothers, and he really has some very soulful things that he does with the guitar. I'd like to have you listen to what he did with a song that I wrote a long time ago. I wrote it for my wife. Uh, it was a thing called Theodora, which is her name. And actually, I wrote it. Uh, I had been playing here at, uh, in uh, Pittsburgh, and I had to go home after the engagement and, and the first thing I had to do was to play a concert in Town Hall, which was wonderful because I'd never played there before. So I wrote this song uh, just before, about an hour or so before the concert. And uh, the, uh, uh, I had a, a trio and uh, the bassist uh, that me, who was with me then was a wonderful bassist, he, he had to be because the piano, now this piano is nine foot, uh, so the piano that I was playing at Town Hall was 11 feet. So that's longer than that. So I was over here, and he was over there. And so he had to hear all of the chords that I was playing from that far away. And uh, he did it so well that actually the, re the first record that I had released with that particular song on it, he's playing the bass. So there's not one mistake in it. That's just beautiful. He just could hear everything that was going on. But this gentleman who not only has heard all the chords that I wrote there, but he's added a few and does some other things to make the, the song even more beautiful. And I'd like to have you listen to Russell Malone's version of Theodora.
Russell Malone. 